one word that you would use to describe the return of Yellowstone? Mm. Uh, exciting, but I want to use two words, dangerous and exciting. Love that. Yeah. Can you elaborate? Uh, nope. Got it. But in six episodes, which will go by fast, we'll see why. Got it. Um, how would you describe your last day on set? Did you take any wardrobe items or props? Um, I'm like, ooh. I totally, it was very, it was emotional. Yeah. I was also, no, my bosses don't know this, I was really hungover on my last day. I celebrated one day too early. Um, You're entitled, you work hard. And I think like the hangover attri like attributed to this like real heartfelt, achy sob. Um, it was, it honestly was magical. It was, it was, I love these people so much. It's very better people. Sweet. Yeah, yeah. Um, what will you miss the most about filming this show? I'm gonna miss like the family that we created and I, I'm gonna miss the horses and the cows and the money. <laughs> Lovely honesty. <laughs> um, would you do any other Taylor Sheridan uh, shows or spinoffs? Oh, never, you know, of course. Of course I would. Seems to he's be like so, the main answer. Of course, he's so, Taylor's, he's a freak kind of gifted. He's freakishly gifted. He's got one of the biggest hearts of anybody I've ever met. I feel like he was like a, some kind of older brother that like came in and was like, kid, come with me. Yeah. And I, I feel like that like, his, his heart is so good, and I think people get to see some of that, but he is. I mean, he has to be this big, powerful guy, but he's got the biggest heart, and he balances that with a really big brain, really big brain.